looking into the paranormal veil. Death waits for no one when it calls. Purgatory is the spirit's jail. Built behind the blind man's wall. Catch the specter behind the glass. He repeats the disembodied voice. It all happens when the bones are cast. After death, there is no choice. Looking into the paranormal veil. Death waits for no one when they come. Purgatory is a spirit's jail. Built behind a blind man's wall. Pastors and healers and shamans and poets. We explore the darkened ruins. Bless the good spirits and give them food. Alas, we are coming for you soon. Cheese and Bones Inspectors, we're revisiting the Renaissance building because good old John in the basement raised some questions for us. So here we are again. Uh, so welcome to a second, you know, second part, I guess we could call, of Renaissance buildings. Uh, so again, if you like what you see, hit the subscribe button, hit the bell, let your, people, let your friends know about us. Hey my YouTubians, how you going? Danny here. Uh, from Jason Bones Inspection, and of course I'm with Brock, and we're back here because we have unfinished business. Thank you. Okay, spirits, show me a yes, please. Okay, thank you. Go back, please. Show me a no. Okay, that's a no. Good. All right. Are there lots of spirits here from the past? Lots of older spirits. Yeah? Okay. Now, were these just people that worked in the area or were here for reasons like that? Not of that? Yes. Okay. Are there any ancient spirits here? There is. Okay. Um, the spirit that's here, the ancient, are there, is there more than one ancient spirit? Yes? Okay. Are the ancient spirits here, that, are they good spirits? No. Okay, so there's two? Two spirits? Okay. But they're not good spirits? No again. Ask the question. Is there one good spirit and one bad spirit? Is the bad spirit connected to John downstairs? Yes. Was Beelzebub, when last time we were here, part of John? Definitely, yes. <laughs> okay. Now the good spirit, is it upstairs? Yes. Does it go downstairs? No. Is the good spirit uh, White Star? Yes. 
White Star, were you my guide for when I was doing other work? Big yes. Big yes. All right, brother. Uh, well, I know you wouldn't be worried about what's downstairs. That's probably why you don't go down there. All right, thank you. We're going to investigate this place. Uh, White Star, keep an eye on things for us. <laughs> okay. All right. Thank you. Okay, as you just saw with you know, Danny and the Rods, um, if you remember when we did a Halloween night, for those who were with us during that, towards the end of our investigation that night, as I was sitting in the old Freaks and Geeks cafe side, there was a great big bang, the building shook, and I felt the floor vibrate underneath my feet. Danny, who was here in this area, which is a good 50, 60 feet away from me, a totally different storefront, also heard the bang as if it was behind him, and the floor shook and vibrated against his feet. I had my box out and I asked what was that and I got the name Beelzebub and I went Beelzebub and then the next word that came up was indeed that's when I decided that was enough of that <laughs> and time to you know and communication now because we felt the floor vibrate the way it did earlier on Danny uh, had a little bit of an argument with a guy downstairs in the vault named John when I went down there into the vault, I didn't get the name John, but I got a severe you know, pain in the chest. So I'm figuring this John guy had heart problems or something like that. We figured he was a businessman or some kind or you know, something like that. And then the spirits just told us that Beelzebub is connected to John. Now Beelzebub, if you know, is one of the names for the devil, but as the trickster devil, the Lord of Lies type of deal. Not the, you know, you will perish for your sins devil but more of uh, I'm going to mess with you devil so this is something yeah, we're going to look into and thank goodness we got White Star watching our backs on this one. Name into that uh -huh. Hello spirits, are you around? Hi, how are you? Okay Hi uh, The spirit the spirit that was talking to me by white by the name of White Star, are you here? Hurry. Hurry and go. <coughs> Hurry and go when? What's up? Is there some is there something that you wish to tell us? Look out. Wait there, are you here? He is? Okay. Bra? Yeah, Bra's here. Downstairs. Be careful. Okay, we'll be careful. What about Bra? Bra saw what? Say that again. I'm sorry, I'm just list, trying to listen and put together a sentence that's what they're saying. So what is it downstairs? Are you referring to the red lights that Ross saw when he was down there? Yes? All of them? What was that?
Reaper. Again, with Reaper. Okay, we'll check into it. Remember? Okay, we will remember. Yes. Okay, spirits, I'm gonna I'm gonna hand this now. All right. Uh, we got lots to check out yet, so uh, we'll be going downstairs shortly. Uh, so good spirits, you know, keep an eye on us. We'll talk to you soon. Bye bye. Okay, so it keeps talking about uh, when Bra was downstairs, she saw a bunch of red lights last time. And it's saying that all the red lights were part of a reaper. Um, so we're going to have to find out what that's all about. We'll talk to you soon. You're on. Alrighty, people. Alrighty, Tubians. Here we are back at the, where I got. Very interesting uh, hit on the paratech. So here we go again. Oh, intention. Good word to start off with intention. And my intention is to find out what happened the last time. Spirits that are here. Remember what happened last time? Can, can you tell me who was here? This. Is this here still? Or is this me uh, talking with the talking to you with the, this box? You have. I have talked to you with this box, yes. Year. Year. Something, something uh, to do with this year? Something to do with November of this year? Is there something that's supposed to be happening? No. Kill. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm not planning on killing anybody this year, thanks for asking. And we don't want to be killed. <laughs> and we don't wish to be killed. Could, could you clarify that a little bit? Who's going to be killed this year? Eight. Eight. The number eight. Not the word. The number. Engine. Engine. Number eight. Engine. They're not communicating. Details. Well, I'm, I guess we are out looking for the details to find out what's going on. That's it. All right. We're going to end the, end the communication down, Spirits. Thank you. Scanning stops. Well, talking with the Spirits is clear like mud. <laughs> so, like I said, like, this is, like, last time I was here, it was nice and warm. This is chilly. As soon as I walked up here. So, there is something more going on here than the last time. So let's go and find this out, shall we? Alright. Talk to you all soon. Okay, we're back again. Um, you probably won't notice to, because Danny's such a great editor at these kind of things. You know, we just took a break, we you know, regrouped. Now we're about to go downstairs. Uh, last time we were here, uh, like the over in the freak side, it was warmer. Now it's a whole lot cooler, a lot more energy is shaking going down there. Now we're going down here to find out about those things that we encountered last time. So there's questions that need to be answered. Uh, I was supposed to mention something, but I forgot what it was. No, no. Thanks. Next time we remind me to tie a string on my finger. <laughs> but yeah, so we're going to go downstairs. We're going to you know, see if we can get some more definitive answers or more questions that we have no idea what they mean. Right, and, and the one thing of note, it's a little more nervous to go down this time than last oh, time. Oh yeah, my, yeah, I'm a lot more nervous now because I know it's down there, whereas before I knew it was over there, but now that what I felt before, it felt safer the first time we were up here, 
Now it doesn't feel as safe over there as it did the first time. So it's not feeling as safe. So they know we're coming, and we know that you know. So you know. Uh -huh. All right. You wish to say anything? Nope. Let's get her done. All right. Okay. I'm gonna just do the rods here. Before we do anything else, I just want to try my rods out. Mm. Uh. Oh, spirits, are you here? Yes. Are there good spirits down here? Yes. Are the negative ones here too? Definitely yes. Any questions? Are they worried about us being here? Yes. Are the good spirits okay with us being here? Well, I'm okay with that. I'm okay with that, too. Yeah. Those uh, lights, that broad saw, is that one of the mysteries you want us to look at? Is that something that you want us to... Well, well you could let me finish the question, but okay. <laughs> I think they know what you're getting at. I think they know. Okay. <laughs> they're not sure about if they know or not? No, they're tracking that guy. He's okay. No, he's not. No, he ain't. Point with the other rod if, if that's the guy that you want us to track. Okay, as you can see, they're both pointing exactly the same direction. All right, we'll, we'll check into that. So, is that good? Okay. All right. Ah, it looks like we got some investigating to do. All right, good thing we're here then. We just saw movement in that little hallway there that Broad's going over to. Hey, buddy. Government. You know, we're not with the government. Were you with the government? Direct. Indirect. Indirectly with the government? Do you have something to do with engine number eight? Were you a train marshal? Okay, so it's like CN police or something like that. Okay, I'll check it. All right, I'm going to end communication now. The number seven. 
That means you're on track. Uh-huh. All right. Any communication? Okay. Danny, yeah, I'm Danny. Whoa. Whew. Okay, that was a nasty vibe. <coughs> so you're here, you're trying to bug me, but you won't let me see. Who are you? Why are you bugging these other spirits out here? You're absorbing them? Yeah? Any good spirits that are down here, go upstairs. <laughs> Simple as. Okay, I see ya. Just in front of me, there's an outline. I don't know if that be able to pick it up at all. But right there. I'm not picking up anything. I'm zooming in. No. Alright. We got something that skitters on the ceiling. There it goes. There's one over here. I can see it playing. There's a little bit of orange light. Remember that orange light you said? Yeah, it was along the bottom. Yeah, I see it. It's right here. Okay, I'm zooming in. I'm not picking up anything on the camera. Okay, I just heard two bangs right here on this wall. I heard two bangs. Spirits, what is this thing? The ghost, yeah, I know it's a ghost, but what kind of ghost? It's, it's a twisted man? A twisted man named Mark. <laughs> I just got growled at real bad. Break it? No. I'm not here to fight it, I'm just here to investigate it. It's been here longer than me, and I have not been requested to do anything, so I'm not doing anything. Good? You've been here longer than me, so I'm not going to ask you to leave or anything. I'm just letting you know. You cause trouble, and I get called here, I will not back down from you. I hope you understand that. That's good. You understand? I do. At this point, I'm just collecting evidence, trying to prove to the world that things like you exist. And mainly proof for myself and, and my team. Okay, we're going to leave this area now. I guess you can stay here or do whatever. I knew it all. Okay, I'm shutting off this communication. <laughs> oh boy, that was as uncomfortable as giving your grandmother a kiss goodnight and she slips you the tongue. Okay, that was really uncomfortable. <laughs> I was going to say grandfather, but yeah, you're 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 close. Oh yeah, right on right on the mark. All right, well, shall, shall we? Uh, you yeah, know. take a break. I don't know what's here, but it's really uncomfortable. Um, we do want to check out the vault yet, but 
This is probably the first time on an investigation where I'm half-assed wanting to leave. <laughs> I got the willies. Yeah, I don't, I don't like that thing. And because we're not prepared for that kind of shit. Uh huh. Well, I knew there was something here, but that wasn't here last time. No, that's new. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna take a break and we're gonna check the Malto. In this room, I had an interesting conversation with a spirit. Just want to see if that spirit's still here. Hello, spirits. Patty. Patty, hi, Patty. Patty, you were the girl I was talking to last time, correct? Yeah? Distant John Earl. Okay. Are you, are you okay here, Patty? Is everything okay for you? From Patty, spirits, please let Patty speak. Hi. Hi, Patty. Is everything good? Yeah. So, the good spirits here aren't being troubled. I want to hear it from Patty. No. Everything's fine? Okay, Patty, I just wanted to check with you and make sure that the good spirits are all right. We're good? Okay. Don't interact with them? Okay, and to all the other spirits that we're talking, thank you for communicating with us. Yep. <laughs> okay, we're going to check the safe and then we're going to be done, all right? Okay, peace and blessings. Any communications for now? Huh, well, there you have it. So there's lots of spirits here, good ones, and there's a couple negative ones. But apparently, according to good ones, negative ones aren't really bothering them that much. So... That's a good thing. All right, we're going to check the safe. Loaded. Yeah, okay. Uh, we're back at the safe. Uh, There's the underground vault thingy. Um, I just tried to walk in front of the door, and I got a big-ass chill, which I recognize very well. So, let's see what uh, is shaking here tonight. Started scanning. John, you here? Quill. Pen? Okay. Affair. Affair. Okay. John, are you here? Someone's in there. I feel the anger. I did it the last time. Okay, we're going to go ahead and turn that light on so you can get in there. All right. All right, here we go. Oh, Interest. Okay, more you know, more things business related. Hey, John, you weren't happy the last time we were here. John, are you here? Minute. Minute. You'll be here in a minute. Okay. Valley. 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 Mm -hmm. Grace. Valley Grace. Think about it. You know I walk through the valley. Mm -hmm. Amazing Grace. You know I walk through the valley of death. Alright. Should I say my grace before I come in here? Are you threatening me, John? Uh. Up. That's the second time I've been told to go up. So would it be better if we left you alone down here?
Come on, John. Afraid. afraid. I'm not afraid. Maybe John is. John, are you afraid? Were you having an affair, John? Is that why you're angry? There you go. I don't feel you. Intern. Intern. Having an affair with this intern. Uh, an intern? Quiver. Quiver. Shake. Nervousness. Okay. I don't feel the anger anymore. Third. Oh, you guys give me things to ponder. I'll give you that one. Hail. Hail. Hail Mary, full of grace. Everything keeps reporting it, turning to that kind of stuff. Used. John, were you a bad Catholic? I think I touched a nerve. Yep, I felt that too. You got that pain in the chest again from last time. John, did you die of a heart attack? Emma. Emma. Did you have an affair with Emma, or was Emma your wife? Okay, we're getting lots of bangs out here. Yeah, lot, I'm, I'm, I'm hearing from in here. All right, I'm going to end uh, this communication now. I'm going to have to find out some more information about this place. Okay. Or I'll mission. check into it. And I'm going to end this communication now. Thank you for, uh, for your help. Scanning stopped. Yeah. <laughs> when I asked if he was made Catholic, I got to... All right. So that's what I got. And, you know... I keep forgetting to duck down here. Was there shorter people in the past, like in the 30s and things like that? Were they short people? Probably. I don't know. <laughs> All right, let me go in there. I will let you in. <clears throat> okay, I'm just going to do one more quick spirit box in here. And then we're going to be done for here. We might come back to this area when we do another space, but we're definitely finished with upstairs. Hello, spirits. Okay, who just touched me? John? John's here. Okay. John, did you just touch my shoulder? You did? Alright. Well, thank you for that. John. Are you a nasty spirit, or were you just pissed off the last time you were here? Talking to you, John. Are you nasty, or were you just angry last time you were here? Angry? I was? Angry I was? How are you connected to the twisted human? All the spirits say you're connected to this twisted human that's down here. Is that true? Yeah? What's the connection? Son? So you're the son of the twisted human? I'm getting nothing but lies. Um, right now, from what I can tell, ending communications, from what I can tell right now, um, the spirits down here, like John, and that, it's nothing but lies. So they're trying to be something that they're not. Um, they're faking shit, and they're lying their ass off. So there's no point investigating anymore. And, uh, yeah, this is, 
not good here. So we're going to get out of here now. All right. Uh, we'll talk to you in a couple minutes. Back in the main room in the basement of uh, this part of the Renaissance building. As soon as we walked in here, we could just feel that rough, I don't want to say evil, but ominous, you know, force just emanating from that doorway now. Again, that wasn't here the last time we were here. So I don't know if we riled something up or something has changed in the, the area or I don't know. It's just, it, it's, it, it's not as upbeat as it was the last time we were here. And I'm not saying that, you know, just to say it, it's like, it's just, you can feel it. More questions than answers. And like I said, I got, you gave me the willies. I'm, fe I'm not feeling well right now. Which is odd for me. Considering the other things that we've gone up against, this is really bothering me. So, that means I want to find out more. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to give this place up. I'm almost tempted to ask uh, Aldo if I can camp out down here. Well, that'd be crazy. Yeah, it would. That would, that would. that would be absolutely That crazy. would be totally nuts. But which means we're going to do we, it. We, which means we're going to ask. Yeah. And I am sober. <laughs> so, yeah. Um, yeah, uh, like weirdness going on. And all the religious references, you know, like hail and grace and... Yeah, so yeah, um, a lot more evidence than the last time that we were here. And a lot more questions and to uh, anybody yeah, like to, I, I'm asking this to all those who have more experience than me if you could figure and tell me how to get a straight answer out of a spirit I'd be ever so grateful <laughs> good luck I'm trying you know, love and light to, to all of you YouTubians uh, you know subscribe you know give us a comment give us a like uh, any suggestions always open for that and you know this is how us crazy connects do it See ya. Okay, my YouTubians, here we are. Um, yeah, no, this place is different. Uh, this definitely is something new. Now, I think it's always been here. Uh, but like I always tell you, whenever you go to a place to investigate, even if you've been there before, always consider it a new investigation and a new place because you never know what's going to show up, okay? I think in this case, the last time we were here, this thing just wasn't here, okay? This time we came, it's here at the same time we are, okay? Um, it's probably been here forever. It feels like it's part of the area. I don't know. It's, it's really weird. Um, and it's, it, it is nerve-wracking in a bit. It, it is really kind of crazy, uh, to say the least. And, and like Rob was saying... Uh, for us to stay here overnight, like do a 24-hour vigil and just be in this area here, would be really, really, really stupid. Real dumbass thing to do. Uh, not bright, uh, which is why we're probably going to do it. You know? Yeah, we just need to figure out where to plug in the coffee maker. Yeah, we just need to know where to put the coffee maker. Um, yeah. But otherwise, uh, that might be something we end up doing just because we're not enough to do it. Uh -huh. Anyway, uh, yeah, at least an overnighter, 12-hour uh, uh, dusk till dawn sort of a deal. Um, yeah. Yeah, that's, that's really weird. It's not very often that I get nervous, and for whatever reason, that, that makes me a bit nervous. Anyway, until next time, take care of yourselves. Take care of your family. Watch out for ghosts. And have a great day. Bye, yeah. all.
catch the specter behind the glass. He repeats a disembodied voice. It all happens when the bones are cast. After death, there is no choice. Looking into the paranormal veil. Death waits for no one when they come. Purgatory is a spirit's jail. Built behind a blind man's wall. Pastors and healers and shamans and poets. We explore the darkened ruins. Bless the good spirits and give them food. Alas, we are coming for you soon. Looking into the paranormal bed. Death waits for no one when he comes. Purgatory is the spirit's dream.